Do you want to do you want to read or? Um, do you guys want to attempt to read? It's it's. I'll do whatever. Let me get to watch to do, this happen though. Yeah. And we don't have one with all five of you, so. I don't mind. Yeah. So yesterday, man, are that's we cold blooded. Vote, or which, are we doing? We, did we decide that because you guys messed it up? Do you yeah. want to be Kate, Jimmy? Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, we you can do the be. big print if you draw. Okay, well, you can out. be. You can be JD. I don't mind. It's better than I do it. <laughs> All right, so yesterday we, we kind of messed it up and mixed it up. I think today we'll do it straight. We'll do it yes. straight. Okay, you guys want to see it nobody straight? Nobody wants to hear Leo. Nobody wants to hear me do no. any kind of other voice. I, <laughs> I think my Marcus yesterday was spot on. That was awesome. It was pretty awesome. awesome. All right. Can we give, can we, for the people... You needed a shot of whiskey and a cigarette, wait, wait, though. Wait, that that would have helped you out. For the people who didn't get to hear it yesterday, Come can on. you just give us, like, just read one line with your killer Marcus voice. Welcome home, James. <laughs> I'm thinking of this cute evil That sounds mouse. like Marcus Phoenix on like helium or I know, something that's like what that. I was aiming for. No, that's pretty, yeah. I mean, that's about like the cutest. Mouse six pitches yeah. higher. Wow. Oh, Just the okay. cutest little Marcus you could ever imagine. That's funny. All right, well, it'll, it'll, it'll be <laughs> gears that's the Ron, voice I'm, of the. Uh, Ron, I'm going to have you set up the scene so we can get right into it, okay? Okay, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to let. That's I, the voice of the Funko you, toy. That's what that is. Yeah, it is. You have your glasses? Are you good? If I put you on the spot, I apologize. Nobody wants to hear me talk, so... Do Paige, is that the man like that? I want to know what this character, this mini Marcus would look like. I feel like this is a way to go. This is a it's kind of like a pause. Oh, yeah. this, is, this is exactly what it's like in the booth. See Rod, and he's working with the talent, telling him what to do. This is, look at the... Right? Right? How good he is at this? This is, this is what Rod does to us in the booth. What? Okay. What so, uh, Jimmy's going to kick us off. He's an art narrator. Oh, my okay. God. Mm, cool. Interior Marcus's farmhouse night. JD pushes open the door of the farmhouse and steps inside. Dell and Kate follow. The lights inside the space are few and dim. Across the room, seated and wreathed in darkness, we see the, silhouetted, the silhouette of Marcus Fenix. Welcome home, James. How'd you know we were here? Marcus looks over to his left at a small bank of closed circuit camera screens. That's new. Not that new. Dad, we need your help. Marcus stands. I'm all done helping you. This time we're not running from the cog. Del, you win this too. Waist deep. You're supposed to keep him out of trouble. Now you know that's not possible. <sighs> I'd introduce myself, but you'll be leaving soon. JD, show him. Show me what? Our village was attacked. And my mother was taken. Taken? Along with all our friends. Dad, you should look at this. No, you look. I warned you not to join the cog. What did you do? Dad. I told you, don't go outside or the cog will hunt you down. Again, what did you Wait, do? You shut up and look. Shit. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's, I know, it's just an audience. <laughs> Del notices cog soldiers approaching the farm on one of Marcus's closed captioned screens. Uh, guys? Thought you said you weren't running from the cog. Yeah, that wasn't completely accurate. God damn it, James! <laughs> and scene! <laughs> Excellent. Thank you very much. <laughs> 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 That's all, folks. No, no, no. Okay. Awesome. See? Wow. That's cool. Like, see? Now you that know that it's true. a little different than yesterday. It did feel so. I yeah. felt like my voice was more... felt good. <laughs> you sounded <laughs> less Australian. I did sound a little less. Yeah. Oh, go, do your JD. Go oh, on. Here's my JD. Ready? Here we go. Hold on. I gotta get the picture. So this, this is pretty accurate. You can compare it. Hey, do you know we were here? <laughs> well, that's new there. <laughs> Dead. We need your help. I mean, it's pretty close. It's kind of. It's <laughs> more, it, yeah, it's, uh, apparently it's more Kiwi than Aussie, so I got I don't know. I don't know where you got that from. <laughs> I think it's pretty good. No, mine was, no, no, no. Mine was maybe. Dad? Yeah. Dad? What are you Dead? doing, Dad? <laughs> Why do you have to always swear, Dad? <laughs> I asked teach you me bad habits. Never to do that voice again. I asked you never to do that voice again. <laughs> it was a slightly different annoying voice. I was upset. Oh, look at that. that weird thing <laughs> I'm sorry. Look, I'm saying, he did tell me. I'm oh, Jesus. See, you're driving them out of the room. We're down to seven now. Look what you've done. I'm sorry on behalf of the group. 